So this part, machine optimization, offerings that go beyond the machine, what does that mean for Siemens? Yeah, from, uh, for Siemens, you know, the motto of this booth uh, and this stand is infinite opportunities from infinite data. So everything is about collecting data, capturing the data, um, analyzing the data, and from there, take it and uh, do your process improvements. So can we just quickly run through the dashboard, some of the elements? Sure. Let me start, uh, first of all, with the, um, with the industrial PCs. So we have three industrial PCs that collect the data directly at the machine. Mm -hmm. High frequency data, we are not talking about any data, which is absolutely important in the production process uh, on the shop floor. And depending on the customer needs, you can have a big one, a smaller one, a middle-sized one, and, a, and, uh, and also a small one. And basically the advantages are you collect data directly where the data comes up from the machine at the shop floor. So that's one thing. Then it considers existing IT infrastructure and security aspects, that's the second point, and it adds technology to an inhomogeneous environment. Mm -hmm. So these are really the benefits for our machine builders and uh, also the uh, machine mm -hmm. users. Um, what's, and what's the outcome of this? We, we're just looking to improve throughput on our machine, make more money essentially. Absolutely. So in order to uh, lift and to improve the production process and to increase productivity, you need data. Data is the gold and there are infinite opportunities. So what you basically do is that you collect the data, for example, and then you can set parameters. And I can show you that here when you see our uh, portfolio in the software apps. You can analyze your work piece via a monitoring function, for example. So in other words, you define thresholds uh, uh, maximum and uh, minimum levels and then basically you observe your production process mm -hmm. and once the production process goes out of that what we call the green tube mm -hmm. then you get an alarm for example and then the machine operator knows I have to intervene in my production process. Okay and if we keep going and there's a lot more to talk about. Of course. Uh, what else? Uh, when it comes to process stability, so quality is one thing mm. that is just explained here with our monitoring function. Then we have process stability as well, where you basically not uh, focus on the uh, quality of the production process, but on the process stability. And we have with Analyze My Condition, you have a test-based condition analysis where you see your production process and how the machine works and what the situation is. Protect My Machine Setup, very interesting. As you can see, we have a camera that basically detects everything what is going into the production process, analyzing it, and there's an ID-based uh, setup verification for the workpiece and the tool. So when that job comes back, you can get it, you know where it needs to go. Absolutely, and that's uh, what it's all about on the shop floor. That's genius. And then last but not least, process efficiency, for example, uh, is also a um, uh, topic that is very important. Mm -hmm. Here we are talking about, again, optimize my machining. Here, magazine. So what we try to do is magazine placement optimization, which is really an important lever to uh, improve your production process. For me, Siemens, if I've got a Siemens control but none of these add-ons, can I grow the Siemens? Do I, have to, do I have to buy everything straight away or can I grow into it? Absolutely, you can grow with it. You do not need necessarily to buy all these software apps. It really, we, dip, uh, we, we analyze the situation with our customers and then we uh, offer him um, the solutions mm. that we have, but as well, and that is a very important point, we can also support him by developing his own apps. It doesn't need to be Siemens apps. So that means we provide him the infrastructure to collect data from the machine, and then he can develop mm. software apps by himself. It doesn't need to be software apps from Siemens. Mm -hmm. Of course, we would like them that he buys that, but we can uh, develop also the infrastructure pr uh, provided to him, and he can develop it based on his own mm. needs and algorithms, his specific needs. Siemens staying ahead of the game for your customers, how, how can they make more money? Okay, um, I mean, making more money, of course, on the one hand side, it's, it's all about uh, digitalization and enhancing the digitalization. To be very honest, digitalization is in its first steps only. There is a change in the industry, I can tell you, a really a change in the industry. People understand that they need to act in order to improve their productivity, but it comes and we, we, we see a strongly increasing demand globally about our software applications that we have and we see here a rising interest. But what we need to achieve is to create a pull and a push effect for the machine builders and the machine mm. users. And this is start starting. And once this is really rolling, 
then of course there is a, a return on investment also for us.